Breaking news at five, Temple University's acting president, Joanne Epps, has suddenly died. The 72-year-old suffering a medical episode this afternoon while on stage at the Temple Performing Arts Center. She was just named interim president in April after the resignation of former president Jason Wingard. I'm Sheba Russell. I'm Jason Martinez. The university just finishing a press conference moments ago that we brought to you live. Let's get right out to Chris O'Connell. Chris, this is just terrible. What else can you tell us? Yeah, guys, no really other way to describe it, but a sad and horrifying day for the Temple University community. University officials just less than a half hour ago confirming to us that interim university president Joanne Epps has died. She fell ill during a university event here on campus. She was rushed here to Temple University where she died late this afternoon. Now Epps was attending an on-campus memorial service for the late historian and author Charles Bloxon. The event was being live streamed at the time. Uh, we're not going to show you when Epps fell ill, but minutes before she seemed alert. She was talking with people. She was greeting guests as she walked around. Several in attendance at the Performing Arts Center told us they were horrified seeing what happened after as Epps had to be carried off stage by first responders. She was rushed to Temple University Hospital where she died a short time later. The cause of her sudden death is not yet known at this early time, but some of her closest friends were there and saw it happen. This is a tragic loss, uh, but we know that Joanne passed away doing something that she loved with her family there and friends and our temple community. The kind heart that she had, um, she had an amazing ability to be the calming force in troubled waters and pull everyone together. Now, Epps had been teaching on the campus of Temple University since 1987. She actually had turned in her resignation papers recently until Temple called her back to uh, turn around the transition after the resignation of former President Jason Wingard. Uh, she was here at this memorial service today. Uh, she passed away a, a short time ago. We can tell you there is a vigil scheduled for tomorrow at Temple University's main campus at the Bell Tower and the university trustees already scheduled a meeting for tomorrow to start looking for another interim president, guys. Yeah, and it's like at this press conference, Chris, understandably they, they had a hard time finding the words to explain their heartbreak and the tragedy of, of this whole thing. Chris, thank you very much. And that video is, is just so upsetting. Uh, as you see her there in the chair, papers down, suddenly slumps in her chair and uh, looks like she's unconscious. It is very, very difficult to watch. That's why we're not showing it to you uh, this evening. Chris, thank you. We want